Hello all, welcome to another quick learning. Today we're going to be going over the update statement in SQL. So you'll learn how to update a particular row uh, to different values in a SQL statement. So here you see I've got a very simple language table. So I've got a language ID and then I've got the name of the language and an update date. So let's say for instance this uh, language ID 6, I made a mistake, I put in German, but this is actually supposed to be Spanish. So how would you write a SQL statement to update that? So here I've written a very simple statement. So you update from the table, so this is the table name language. Set name, so I'm going to change this to Spanish. So this is the column name, so it just happens to be name, you'll see here column name is name and this is what you want the new value to be and then the where statement is important because if you don't include a where statement it's going to change every row in your database uh, for the name and it's going to change them to Spanish so I would suggest if you can uh, use an ID column that's unique so that you're updating only one row if you do have to update all of the fields or all of the fields for some way, then you can use a WHERE clause that's uh, less specific. Uh, but if you can use an ID uh, field that'll just target one row, that's your best bet. So I also, just to show you, I have auto commit on. Uh, so if you don't have auto commit on when you run this query, it won't make a permanent change to the database. It will just go into a buffer and then those changes will be rolled back if you don't commit them. But if I execute this, you can see it updated one, so it updated one row. And then if I go back here and execute this, you can see it changed it to Spanish. So that's pretty simple to do. So this is the basics of an update statement in SQL. I hope you learned something. Thank you very much.